And we want to introduce Raul Aguirre, another foundation board member with Dominic, who will be our MC tonight along with Dominic. So we are going to turn it over to the two gentlemen and let the fiesta begin. All right, but are we going to do a toast first? Oh. Yes, let's do a oh, toast let's do first. first. Yeah, right. toast. How about if we do a toast? Where's the champagne? Like 50 the years! 50 años celebrando el Rio! Uh -huh. There you go, there you go. We need some more, we need some more. Thank you. Right. Thank you, sir. There you go. Okay, right. Raul, will you lead us? And you uh, get on the microphone? I, I will lead you. May the next 50 years continue to be, you know, taking care of our community just like it started in 1970 and now continues to be one of the best systems in the United States, El Rio Health. Salud! Salud, 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 salud. All right, cheers. Dominic and Raul, take it away. All right. So the first thing we're going to do is uh, welcome every one of you. Bienvenidos todos a esta gran celebración. No se les olvide que parte de esta noche es recaudar fondos, el rio.org. So we're trying to uh, meet the fundraising of our uh, chair people who have been working very hard, Dominic and Miriam, and all the board. I want to thank all of the community, all the people that have been working so hard over the last week, I think, it's been phenomenal. The support has been so great. El apoyo de la comunidad ha sido grande. Tell us a little bit about what has been happening this last week, Dominic, real quick. It has been a wonderful time. And first of all, I have to say, welcome everyone. You're there, you could be in your living room, you could be out having some fun. We wanna thank you so much for, in, for joining us because this is our celebration. This is a community celebration. And we know, let's face it, 2020, it's really turned our world, everyone's world, upside down. In front. And, and there he's gonna go upside down. There you go, there you go. Check him out. <clears throat> Yay! But we're still here at El Rio. We're here for you. So wherever you are, and you're gonna hear more stories from Raul, you'll hear the history, the people, what's been going on. Great music from Zona Libre will be playing. Yeah, so now. So make sure that throughout the night, you're gonna stay tuned with us and be ready. Do a little dance, make a little love in your heart and get down tonight. Oh yeah, and, and Dominic and Miriam, Miriam, you know that part of this concept, uh, since we couldn't do it live, you know, like we always do the, the galas, uh, we came up with this concept of doing a, a fiesta in every home, una fiesta en todas las casas, celebrando virtualmente, so virtually we can celebrate, raise money, continue to work because we're opening a new clinic over on uh, Grant and Dodge that is badly needed and all the money that we uh, raised tonight is going there. So tell us, Miriam, cuéntanos. Sí, claro que sí. Yo lo que les quiero decir es bienvenidos a la noche de fiestas y les queremos dar las gracias por acompañarnos Esta noche celebrando 50 años del río. Eso es son una, algunos, ya son algunos. Bastante. Y felicidades al río por todos sus uh, acontecimientos. Y diviértanse en sus casas y nos seguimos viendo. Es viernes en la noche, es Friday night. We want you to party with us. That's why we made it a virtual fiesta in every home in Tucson that is celebrating with us for good health, para buena salud y recaudar fondos. So right now, why don't we kick it off with some great uh, dances, uh, los grupos folclóricos que tenemos hoy. Uh, you know, Julie Gallego is a, oh, truly, I always say, she's a state, a national treasure. This group has gone to the Olympics, They're representing Tucson twice. They gone to New York. They gone everywhere. They celebrated the bicentennial. They were selected by the state uh, cultural people, and they're here with us today to celebrate our 50 years. Please welcome los bailarines, el bailable de nada menos que viva, a performing arts, uh, the Julie Gallego. Bruno, take it away. Vámonos.
Al contrario, ahí está, vámonos, viva performing, dale, dale. Si la piedra es dura, tú eres un día. 
All right, let's bring the mics back. Viva Performing Arts, the Julie Gallego. Big, big round of applause. You know, a lot of people have been working real hard, Dominic, uh, throughout the years, and we want to recognize some of the people, a lot of the real historic influencers. When you think about 1969 and all the movement, the civil uh, rights movement about healthcare and, and health justice, this is what El Rio now has become, one of those hubs where everybody gets taken care of. You know, we take uh, care of so many people's health needs, and we want to thank all the employees who have uh, passionately cared for patients at El Rio over this past 50 years and those caring for patients right now through the pandemic. So it's very important that I know that we have impacted hundreds, hundreds of thousands of lives in multiple generations in this community. Hemos tenido un impacto tremendo en la comunidad, en la salud de la comunidad, en la salud emocional de la comunidad. And we also want to acknowledge all the board members, past and present, and the Rio vecinos for volunteering their time and their service. Absolutely, and truly this is a part of history. Imagine in the 70s, starting out, the first 100 patients, first 10,000, and now 113,000 patients. So clearly, many, many people have participated and helped in this. In fact, too many to mention tonight, but I've got to try. I've got to, got to give some Let's names. go down the list. And Let's go down the list. Have some photos of some, some folks there. That they're doing. Uh, and Raul, you probably know half of the folks. Uh, Dr. Merlin Duval. Dr. Herb Abrams, who really got together at the University of Arizona and the university helped us out this evening. Julia Soto. Yeah, you know, Merlin Duval hired Dr. Herb Abrams and Julia Soto was one of the most passionate employees. A la familia Soto les mandamos saludos porque ella era una de las primeras personas que vino con nosotros cuando yo estaba en la radio en KXCW. And I was doing a lot of radio broadcasting and she said, Raúl, we need to make sure that people know that we can take care of them. So Julia Soto and her family, saludos. Absolutely, still active. Uh, State Representative Andy Nichols, uh, YB Ree, uh, the first CEO, Jose Maltos, uh, Anvel Mejia. A uh, special shout out for Rosa Maria Diaz, mom of a very dear friend, Armando Rios. We really appreciate you. In fact, she was the first female health center board president. Imagine that in the 70s, so clearly an innovator. Juris Poncias, uh, Tony Zumbieta, oh, Cecilia Sarabia Hightower. What a wonderful, a wonderful woman. person, yeah. dear, dear friend who's passed away. And but she was spirit, a real CFO for 25 years. Oh, yes, absolutely. And, and her spirit is really with us tonight. Ramon Robles, uh, Dr. Art Martinez, a good buddy. His daughter became a, a doctor. Uh, Penny Whitley, Alfonso. Alfonso Avitia, Alfonso Avitia, who was one of the a great board members board very chair. early on. Bill Mayor Torina, a social worker, Luis Gonzalez, Jaime Gutierrez. We had a dinner with Jaime Gutierrez. He's still very active in the communi community. Uh, Connie. Connie Irigoya, who is a community health advisor, and Miguel Rojas, who everybody knows. Miguel is from still around. From the Barrio around. 22nd, Barrio Libre, South Tucson, Miguel. Frank Valenzuela, very Another active great in the guy. community. CEO Robert Gomez, Jesse Reese, uh, Richard Spalding, Dr. Dr. Greg Lachance, a special shout out for a very dear friend, uh, a wonderful, wonderful individual. 40 years with the dental director, he recently retired. Uh, Andrew Arthur, Jerry Carlos, he's a great bass player too. El Rio so OBGYN. Delivered <laughs> tons of Jose babies, Rios. tell us about that. And Steve Adam, Rosenfeld. You remember Adam? Yeah, yeah, of <laughs> course. <laughs> And uh, Maria, Maria Valles, longtime employee, 50-year anniversary. Uh, Kevin Carmichael, Kevin uh, really devoted his life and career at, at El Rio, uh, especially de dealing with folks with AIDS. Uh, Bob Thompson, Chief Information Officer. Uh, Catherine Scrag and Greta Gill uh, with midwifery. Uh, Cecilia Adams, Dr. Greta Samoy, uh, Buchanan McKay, Dr. Tony uh, Buturo. Buturo and Kirk Saunders. Kirk's always been there for us. Tony Felix, Mark Raven, Brian Flagg, Casa Maria. Brian what Flagg, where are you, man? You know, feeding <laughs> hundreds every single day. He has a heart of gold. Doug Spegman is out there. Kathy Byrne and our CEO, Nancy Johnson. We love you. We thank you. This is all going. This is the, the starting fundraiser for the great center that's going to be built out there in an area of need and with respect. We build and we take care of the individuals, the patients with absolute respect. 
affordable, accessible health care. It's been the history of El Rio, and we right, want to thank you again. Continue. All right, right now, Dominic, uh, we thank you for your leadership. Please welcome the music of one of the top, 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 the best. I mean, I love this band. Please welcome Sona Libre. Yeah. Done it, guys, Woo. brother. Make it sound.
bienvenidos. Zona Libre para ustedes. We're going to continue with some salsita, some salsa music. Big round of applause for our wonderful presenters, Raul Aguirre and Dominic Ortega, doing a fantastic job. Thank you, guys. I want to thank Jill Rodriguez for inviting us to be part of such a special event. We're going to continue with the salsa number, take you way back to the day. Here we go. Oh, my. 
amor, muchas gracias. We have time for one more, or are we going to go inside? Okay. Then vamos a cambiar. We're going to do some English music for you guys. Something in English. Let's go and do uh, one of Dominic's favorite tunes, something by Bruno Mars. All right, here we go. All right, all right, all right. Zona Libre. Yeah, we're going to be switching up. We're going to be going to inside. We're going to come back with Zona Libre. It's the 50th annual celebration of El Rio Health. Doing wonderful things. Bienvenidos todos ustedes que están haciendo su pachanga en su casa. You couldn't have a better band in the world. Zona Libre will be coming right back to you. And uh, we're going to go inside right now. Don't forget... We're also doing a fundraiser. This is the main thing. So please send your donations to elrio.org. We're going to be giving away. Uh, Brenda, come over here. What's the number? What's the number where they can call with their donations? You can call tonight at 205-4947. That's 205-4947 or elrio.org backslash donate. 
Yeah. Okay, we're donate. Gonna, we're going to hear from Dr. Spigman before we go to that video, too. All right, well, let's do it right Let now, then. Introduce. Let's do it right now. Dr. Doug Spigman, our chief clinical officer with El Rio, Dr. has a Stanley, few words this way. for Come on, take this mic. Take this all mic. Right. Well, hello, everyone, and uh, thank you. Super close to it. Thank you very much for uh, supporting El Rio. El apoyo que le dan es tremendo. Yeah. And I just want to say to all of you, please, from the bottom of your hearts, if you agree with our mission, if you understand that what we live and breathe to do is to give back to our community, please see it within your hearts to support this effort. El apoyo de ustedes son todo. Muchísimas gracias. Thank you all. 50 years living the legacy, and the legacy continues. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. All thank right. you Give so a big round of applause. Dr. Absolutely. Spagner, thank you. Over 100,000 lives being served in uh, 12 different uh, clinics all throughout the, uh, the city, and about to all that we fundraise tonight is going for the new clinic at Dodge and Grant. Yes, yeah. yeah. so Grant and Dodge, a wonderful new project you're going to Hear a little bit more about that from Nancy as the night goes on. And I think we have a video coming up here. We have some beautiful children it. that helped us recently to thank our healthcare workers. They have been on the front line since this pandemic hit and serving this community, both internally in our clinics and through outreach efforts. So we had a very special treat when we had a number of children who came to the Congress site a few weeks ago with thank you signs uh, for our frontline workers. So. I think if we're ready to queue up the video, uh, let us know. Otherwise, we will keep talking here for a few minutes. We keep asking so. for money. I, I think every little <laughs> bit, okay, por favor. Todo lo que puedan dar, cualquier cosita, 10, 15, 20, 100, 1,000, 10,000. Uh, lo que puedan dar ayuda siempre a El Rio. Every little bit helps. Yes, and we're matching up to 140,000 thanks to three amazing donors tonight. That is the... The Mooney Foundation. Okay, we're going to the video now. Thank we got the you. video. Let's okay, go. Okay, let's hit the video. Shirley, the sign. Take a picture with Dr. Shirley. Yay, thank you. Rick and Lynn Grayson. 
Thank you, guys. Good job. Good job. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Fiesta de Noches. Welcome back, welcome back. We're having welcome a wonderful back. celebration. We hope you're dancing in your living room, and thank you for those donations that are coming in. We just got a lovely $50 gift, a $2,500 gift, a $25 gift, so you can donate at elrio.org. Now it's my pleasure to introduce our Chief Operations Officer, Josh Carzoli, to say a few words. Good Josh. evening. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Brenda, for that introduction, and thank you for our evening host tonight, Dominic. Thank you for all that are joining us via tonight and thank you for the donations. We're very excited to be assisting more patients in our community with our new health center opening up in the Grant and Dodge area. We'll be able to help about 4,000 patients and these, this is an area of a neighborhood that is uh, in great need. So we appreciate your support. Most importantly, want to recognize and thank uh, and recognize the 50 years of service here in Tucson for El Rio. I uh, want to thank all those that have been here working here now and those that have come before us. Thank you. Thank you so much for the sacrifices, the legacy that you've left. Uh, El Rio is an amazing, amazing organization, does so much for our, our community. So we want to thank all of you. And do you have something in Spanish to yes, say, Josh? Yes. Felicidades a El Rio por 50 años de servicio a Tucson y a todas las personas que trabajado aquí y a ustedes que trabajan aquí, muchas gracias por todo. Gracias. Thank you so much. All right. All right. All right. Nancy, why do you want to share? Go ahead. Let us know what just happened. Go real close oh, to the real mic. Real quick, real quick to the mic. We just got a paddle in with a gift for a thousand dollars for the yeah for the new El Rio Health Center on Grant Road. They'll open in late summer, 2021. Thank you. $1,000, all right, $1,000, and then your 25, your 50, your 100, de veras, todo, todo nos ayuda mucho, muchas gracias por estarnos acompañando este aniversario, 50 años del río, sirviendo a la comunidad, and I'm going to bring our chairwoman of the board, Kate Calhoun. Kate, Hello. how are you? They tell me that we got to get real close. I'm we not have sure. to get we really close to, check, to the mic. But thank you for all your work. Uh, you know, we welcome you, and I know you've done amazing. You just started, I think, during the pandemic. Yes, uh, we have. I, I'm Kate, Kate Calhoun. I'm president of the El Rio Foundation Board, and I work with a amazing group of individuals who are so passionate about El Rio. Um, we take our leadership from Nancy Johnson and from Brenda Goldsmith, and they have led us onto a successful road where we get to open up a new building on Grant and Dodge, and your support will help us open up that building and make it successful. There are community members in that area that need our help medically. So your donation will help. Um, go to elrio.org slash donate. We greatly appreciate it. Um, on behalf of the foundation, we've been making some telephone calls inside. We've got some great um, donations coming in. And thank you so much for all that you do. And thanks for tuning in virtually. A brand new way to have an event. Go figure. Oh, yeah. And you can also call at 205-4947 with your donation. 205-4947. And Kate, you are completely right. You know, when we started planning this whole event, we didn't know what to do. And then we came into having a a virtual fiesta gala that means that you can have a fiesta in every home party with us donate party with your friends have your friends send their donations and i think that's a great idea and uh and we thank you for the work that you're doing with the board trying to just steer all these things as we enter a new totally a new era of how to do this kind of things now raul's being shy he's actually one of our board members right <laughs> you're yes, being a little shy He's one of our passionate board members, and I think you all have met Dominic. Um, this event would not have happened without Dominic and his beautiful wife, Miriam. And I'm certainly looking forward to joining a couple friends out there that are having a house party, virtual house party. I'm looking forward to having a glass of wine with you all. So and Anthony Schaefer is having a party. Anthony, Anthony, are you there? check in, brother. Yeah. Anthony is one, uh, one heck of a guy. He was with the Sinos, and now he's the foundation. 
uh, real committed. Him and his wife has, are so committed to to healthcare and to raising money and to help us serve those who uh, who need it. Because you know, El Rio serves everyone. Yes. Everybody. Yes. I mean, I, I am a patient of El Rio. I, I I get all my services from El Rio, and I'm always encouraging people to to say, let's join El Rio. Let's make sure that we bring you know all different kinds of demographics into it in terms of. Uh, you know, because a lot of people think that we only serve the underserved, you know, low income, but we really serve the whole community. So that's another part of it. And people like Anthony Schaefer, people like the, Le Le the Levins, who have been really throwing a party too, right? Yes, Claudia, um, Claudia and Tracy are throwing a virtual party that I think I might like sneak out and go no, join no, no. them. Hey, give me a ride, okay? I I'll go. give you a ride. <laughs> Come with me. I want to go to that me. party. So, yeah, we've got so much going on in the community and we could not do it without you all. And like like you, I am a patient of El Rio. Wonderful. I had my COVID-19 test. I had my flu shot. You all get a flu shot, save a hospital bed for a COVID patient. That's all I got to say there. And by there. the way, I'm glad you mentioned that the flu shots are being given here at El Rio by a is it just walk in or by appointment? I, I don't it's just walk in. So I went to the Congress site on Thursday. I just walked into the Congress site and received my flu shot. It was great. You don't have to be a patient of El Rio to get your flu shot. Um, just check in um, and do your part. And, and they're free. And by the way, if you cannot make it uh, to any of our clinics, don't forget that uh, over at El Pueblo, you can get uh, uh, where also El Rio is at, you can get uh, free uh, uh, shots and, and many other you know public health uh, clinics. Because it's important. You can get your COVID-19 test too. That's correct. Yes. Because it's very important. Now we're going to talk, Dominique, come on over and let's say hello to our major sponsors. We couldn't do anything okay. without them. They're being Come so great. In. We're going to bring in our children FEMA helpers. Medical Institute, All who's right. been great FEMA for Medical. many, many We're years. Have you stand over many, here. Many Come years. on in. Come on Come in. Come on in, kids. Who do we have next? Uh, we have, we the have the Jim Click Family Foundation. Oh, right here yeah, he is. Close. Right here in the Good middle. Job. Show right the camera. The Mooney right Foundation. All right. We've got the Mooney Foundation. And Mooney Foundation. Look at these special assistants. Coming in. Man, these guys are our marketing oh, experts. All right. Oh, They're our marketing Woo! experts. Come behind us, guy. Come. The Levin <laughs> okay. family. The we Levin the family is always such a so great. Levine. Thank you so much. Okay. Hi, Claudia. Hi, everybody. We've got the uh, wonderful Levin family. TEP. Right. Let me move this Woo! way. Fiesta. Coming in. Tucson Love Electric Touché. Power, one Coming of our major sponsors, major partners. Love stuff. it and touche. TMC Healthcare. All right. We've got, and, uh, yeah, TMC. We want to thank all the major sponsors. And we also now have a sponsor reel. So take a look at your video screen and you'll see our many partners on Fiesta de Noches. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Get the thank you sign. Yay. Yay. We'll see Wells Fargo in the house. Welcome back again. We want to thank so much our many, many sponsors. We have many partners. You saw them in the PowerPoint. We are so grateful from the bottom of our heart 
for all these. And Dominic, come on in, because we've been on the other, I'll get on this other mic, or you can. We've been so blessed, haven't we, Dominic, with the number of sponsors who have supported this event. Do you want to share a little update about the sponsorship dollars that have come in in total? About how many sponsor dollars came in tonight? Uh, uh, tonight or the uh, 200? So we actually have over $100,000 in sponsorship, right? <laughs> I'm always thinking big. So yes, we have over $100,000. We have some matching sponsors Numbers. that have come in. Uh, again, this just shows Tucson, Arizona is so supportive as a community, has been so giving as a community. From the first day that it started, the 50 years ago, it, it took the tenacity of the individuals who came together and, and put everything together. But again, it can't happen without the sponsorship, without the donations of, of all the great uh, groups and families. So we sincerely appreciate it. And where can people donate tonight? Where do we want them to go? And, and remind everyone about the amazing match that we have for this new clinic site. Absolutely. The total match is $140,000. So every dollar you give, we just got a donation for $1,000. That was doubled. Yep. So elrio.org on Facebook. Just go ahead and go on there, click, and it will lead you to a link. You can make a donation. And again, it doubles the dollars. So it's, uh, again, the impact that you're having on the community is is tremendous yes it is many of you support a lot of the nonprofits, a lot of the charities within the community already mm -hmm. those individuals are typically recipients uh your recipients are patients at el rio so really it, it is a community effort where we continue to help all of these other groups groups that are uh, part of the charities that each and every one of you support and, and many of these charities as well. And we have so many partner organizations. We work with Emerge this week, right? We've talked about domestic violence awareness and prevention. We are with the food bank and we did a food distribution event recently at the Southeast Clinic location. We have numerous educational partners. They are all on our website at elrio.org. You can see who our partners are. It is really a community-wide effort that makes El Rio a success. And we could not be any more grateful from the bottom of our hearts. You have touched us this week as we have done seven days of celebrating. It's been phenomenal. And you have stepped up, Tucson. It's been every day. There's been donations coming in. We also want to let you know that Channel 4, thank you to KVOA. Also, the Arizona Daily Star is going to have a Sunday newspaper article about the 50th anniversary and El Rio Health. So we encourage you to look at the newspaper as well. We are going to turn it over to the band if they are ready to hit it so we can get to some more dancing. Zona Libre, here they go. Go, brother. All right, we'll give ourselves a break for a second. Let's figure out where the hell we Como dulce melodía esa noche Tu nombre penetró en mis sentidos Y se metió tan adentro, tan adentro Que por eso salí no ha podido Me coloqué como si fuera tu de magia En un espacio colorido e imaginario Situado en Bajo tu hechizo y tus gemidos excitantes Que deslumbrado por aquellas sensaciones De tanto amar casi te veo en cada frase Vamos a hacerlo adelante Una antología de caricia De lo mejor de la primera noche Cuando ahí Solo 
Vamos a hacerlo adelante Una antología de caricias De lo mejor de la primera noche Del amor que endulza nuestras vidas Aún yo guardo en mi pudor El dolor de tu primera vez Un dolor Supo a miel y una piel que grita a ver, ven endulzame otra Gracias, gracias. We got time for another one? Okay, we're going to continue uh, with a cha-cha, something by Michael Bublé. Uh. Once again, thank you guys so much. Please uh, make sure to keep those donations coming in. We want to thank El Rio for having us. Brenda Goldsmith, thank you so much. Joe Rodriguez, Dominic and Miriam, Raul, all the crowd. Thank you guys for being here this evening with us, virtual. Here we go. Start to play, dance with me, make me sway like a lazy ocean hugs the shore. Hold me close, sway me more like a flower bending in the breeze. Bend with me, sway with ease. When we dance, you have a way with me. Stay with me, sway with me. The dancers may be on the floor, yeah, but my eyes will see only you. Only you have that magic technique. When we sway, I go weak. I can hear the sounds of violence long before it begins. Make me thrill as only you know how. Sway me smooth. Dancers may be on the floor, yeah, but my eyes will see only you. Only you have that magic technique. When we sway, I go weak. I can hear the sounds of violins long before it begins. Make me thrill as only you know how. Sway me smooth, sway me now.
Muchas gracias. Thank you so much. I will switch you back over. Ending. Yeah, doing their thing. Fantastic They're one of the best group. bands, not only in the state, I think in the country. They do so well. They're really, really great. And uh, Iram, thank you for being here with us. Uh, again, a lot of talent uh, in this band. And uh, we're having a fun time. I saw you dancing. We're having a hip, great time. My friend bit is going crazy. And we've got some numbers for you. So again, we want to say thank you, Tucson. Thank you, the area, for all of the donations. So let's get a little drum yeah, roll. Yeah, drum roll. And ready to hold up the sign. So hold far, $75,400. Ready to raise this evening. Get the mics out of the way. So Seventy-five thousand four hundred. And numbers uh, are going up. So again, we appreciate now, Dominique, your support. Now, Dominique, that's seventy-five thousand four hundred, Brenda and Dominique, of the one hundred and forty match. Is that what we're talking about? Correct. So we're getting we, close. We are getting close to the match. So again, we've got the one hundred and forty match. This we're halfway so there. Spell it out to we're going to so, do it before so the end of the evening. We get another 140. Absolutely. So we want to hit that $280,000 mark. We know with Tucson. Oh, yeah, baby. With your support, we'll do it. Fabulous. Alex, we love you, baby. TMC, thank you so much. Some great matching donations. We sincerely appreciate Thank and you so much. And the Levins are throwing a party too. We wish you were there, but we said they're dancing. Woo! Dance with the this number 75,400. We're going back to Zona Libre. Yeah, Woo! baby. Make it sound. Okay, come on. Por tus paisajes preciosos, por tu aguardiente sabroso, quiero cantarte Colombia. Baila mi cumbia, baila mi porro, baila mi salsa y mi merecumbe. Baila mi cumbia, baila mi porro, baila mi salsa y mi merecumbe. Con el calor de tu costa y el fuego de tus mujeres, no hay en el mundo placeres como en mi tierra sabrosa. Baila mi cumbia, baila mi porro, baila mi salsa y mi merecumbe. Baila mi cumbia, baila mi porro, baila mi salsa y mi merecumbe. Colombia. Muchachos, bailen la cumbia porque la cumbia emociona. La cumbia llena guerra que se baila suave sol. Vamos a bailar la cumbia porque la cumbia emociona Pero que baila mi cumbia que está rica y sabrosona La cumbia llena que era que se baila suave zona Vamos a bailar la cumbia porque la cumbia emociona
Thank you. One more. All right. I'm gonna keep going with some more music, ladies and gentlemen. Vamos a cambiar. We're gonna do something by uh, Michael Jackson and shake it up a little bit for you guys. Okay. All right, we're gonna flip the camera around. This is what happens when you go live. It's and and also, if you don't know what, what we're doing, you just turn us on. This is what's happening Woo! right now, live on Facebook. <laughs> El Rio 50th anniversary, 50 years, 50 años de servir a la comunidad. Go for it, Brenda. All right, we're going to turn it over. We're going to one of our mini fiestas happening with one of our wonderful families that supports us in a big way. We're going to be turning it over to Mike Levine and coming in from Zoom on one of the mini fiestas. All right, Mike. Woo! Okay, we're not there yet, so hold <laughs> the sign. Hold Where's the sign? Thing. Where's the sign? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we there Is now? Did Mike in? Did Mike get in? All right, sounds good. So we're live. Live or not? Are we live with the group there? Okay, great, super. Okay. All right, well, um, it's uh, Mike and Claudia Levine here at the Mount Oyster Club with our group. Um, we're uh, really happy to be part of the uh, event tonight. Uh, you know, we have a good turnout here, but uh, still maintaining social distancing and making sure to be safe with everyone. Uh, as you see, we have our really awesome El Rio masks on and uh, you know, we're following Arizona State guidelines uh, as far as, uh, you know, how to best uh, be safe and uh, conscientious uh, at restaurants and, uh, and being out and about. So uh, I'm going to try to switch my uh, uh, camera around here. Or actually, before I do that, I just want to mention that um, our family are longtime supporters of El Rio. Um, we have believed very much in El Rio's vision and in the project at Grant and uh, Dodge. Uh, we think it's going to be a huge benefit to our, or we know it's going to be a huge benefit to our community. Uh, we just um, we just feel so strongly about this project that uh, we really want to do something special as far as this 50 year anniversary. And so we uh, we hosted the event here at the Mountain Oyster Club. And uh, we're just uh, you know, really, really thankful for El Rio being in our community and, and spending this 50 years helping so many people uh, as part of our um uh, you know, we've been longtime supporters of El Rio, but this year, as part of the 50-year anniversary, uh, our family, the Alan and Jan Levine family, has donated $20,000 as a matching grant uh, of what I believe is a total of $140,000 towards matching, so that for every dollar that uh, people donate, uh, it's matched with an extra dollar, and uh, so it doubles your, what you're contributing to this very worthwhile project. So, uh, and Mike and I have decided that this year, he and I, our family, the Mike and Claudia Levine family, is going to donate an extra ten thousand dollars for this goal because we believe so much in what El Rio is doing and we support the Grant and Dodge effort completely. So I'm just gonna flip our camera around here real quick if I can, and uh, just so you can see. Yeah, you know, we have a really nice turnout here. Um, you know, been able to get a really good group together and follow social distancing uh, guidelines, staying safe, and I think more enjoying being able to get out in a safe manner and to do the kind of things that they've, uh, you know, that we haven't been able to do. So uh, we uh, we're really uh, happy it worked out this way and happy that, to support El Rio. So. Uh, other than that, we're enjoying this wonderful weather. Uh, we're all outside, uh, and so looking forward to hearing how uh, um, Rio does as far as uh, the whole uh, gala does as far as uh, raising money for this, like I said, very worthwhile event. <laughs> Have a wonderful evening, and uh, please, if you feel you're, you're uh, led to, uh, please contribute to this project.
I'm just going to share the stage with my friend, Rashandra, one of our El Rio vecinos. Hello. <laughs> and we have the pleasure now, Rashandra. Who I, are we going to, we're going to throw it to somebody's party. I get the pleasure of announcing my vecino brother in love, Anthony Schaefer. Thank you guys so much for everything. We're going to throw it to your party and let you guys show them how we get oh, yeah, down. Ready. That's right. <laughs> Anthony's fiesta. Take it away. Yeah, we might need a dance. Yeah. 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 Oh! Let's go! Okay, Dominic and Raul, we're coming in on the left. What's up? Let's go! What's up, everybody? Hope you're having a beautiful night. Congrats, El Rio, on 50 years. My name's Anthony Schaefer. Hope you can hear me okay. We got Emily here with me as well. I am your vice president of the foundation board and been supporting El Rio for nearly a decade. We've got some of our favorite people here tonight. I just got to pan it around to show you our house party here. Let's go. I can't hear you. So clearly, 
family. We're all having an awesome time for El Rio. We want to remind everybody, don't forget to uh, tag your post, hashtag El Rio 50, or hashtag... No Shade Day Fiestas. No Shade Day Fiestas. Yes, awesome. We hope everyone's doing awesome out there and raising a lot of money for a beautiful cause. We're super excited to see the Grant and Dodge building go up. And uh, much love to everybody out there. We'll see you guys soon, okay? One more time, everybody. <laughs>
Zona Libre, folks. It's Woo! happening. Look at this Excellent number. Excellent job. Thank Look you at so this much, number. Zona Libre. Dominic, Miriam, talk to me. Look at those numbers. Okay, great years. news, everybody. Tucson, thank you so much. You had some ideas of how we'd raise some money. We have a specialist ready boys. to help us out. We we'll raise some money <laughs> tonight. We have sponsorship dollars as well. So with the drum roll so far, we have raised $241,753. And we still have more matching dollars. So we can keep this going to 260, 270, $300,000. The sky's the limit, but it's incredible. So let's keep going. Yeah, 300 will be really nice. You know, it's going, all of it is going, Brenda, get over here. Uh, all of it is going to the new clinic on Dodge and Tucson, uh, and uh, yeah, Tucson Boulevard. Tucson Boulevard. Tucson Boulevard. And Grant, Every yes. Grant yeah, Grant, Grant and, and Dodge. Dodge, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, we don't want another <laughs> clinic. That's too close. And uh, you know, you and me enjoying the music at Zona Libre, a great, amazing group. We wanted to, everybody to have a great time. This virtual fiesta gala, uh, you know, the Schaefers are having a great time. The Levins, thank you so much. What a donation. That's Mikey, amazing. Claudia, thank you so much. Tucson Electric Power, we want to thank them for their fantastic gift. The Mooney Foundation, it's been phenomenal, everybody. We also want to give a shout out. It is Breast Cancer Awareness mm -hmm. Month, and we have an event coming up next week that is being done for us in the community called Briskets for Breasts. So look for that on Facebook. Get your $10 ticket for some great barbecue on October 31st and support our breast cancer treatment fund. We have those such great needs, huh, Nancy, for our, our patients that have no insurance to get breast cancer treatment. So I'm going to let Raul and Dominic bring it home with the band, get the music going, because it's been a great, great evening. Turning it back over. Thank you. Big round of applause for Brenda Goldsmith. Yeah, Brenda, Nancy, thank you. Thank so you. The and of course, team, our the foundation whole team. Brandon never takes credit. It's the whole team. We love, every, we love you, Brandon. And, and the whole community as well. I, I like to thank everybody. We're getting closer and closer to our, our goal, I think. And don't forget uh, uh, breast awareness. And of course, let's continue to practice, uh, you know, safe distance, uh, wear masks, wash your hands, you know, practice, practice, practice. I know that that's what, something that we've been talking a lot uh, because we want to make sure that we, uh, you know, make this uh, uh, go down. The, the wave uh, has to go down a contagion. And at the same time, we want to continue to have this community vibrant and healthy to do great work. So thank you, Tucson. Muchas gracias. Vamos a irnos con la música de Zona Libre. We thank you and keep sending your donations to El Rio. Sí, gracias. Gracias a todos. Thank you, Tucson. It's a fabulous evening. We ready thank for you, some everyone. more music? All the volunteers, Musica! Oh, hey! hey! We're gonna sing you guys a song with the ultimate party song. We are Sona Libre. Thank you guys for being here this evening with us. Here we go! Do you remember 21st night of September? Love was changing the minds of pretenders.
Okay, we're gonna close off with a nice cumbia. All right. Cuando tú me llamas, siento cosquillitas en mi corazón. Sabes que te quiero mucho, que te pienso tanto, que sueño en tu amor. Tita, cuando tú me besas, no sé qué me pasa, que me pongo a temblar. Como yo te quiero, Tita, nunca encontrarás a ningún amor. Tita, Tita, cuando yo te beso, Tita, siento cosquillitas, Tita, en mi corazón. Siento cosquillitas, tita, en mi corazón. Thank you so much. Zona libre para ustedes. Have a wonderful.